Couldn't take it, couldn't stand another minute. Couldn't bear another day without you in it. All of the joy that I had known for all my life was stripped away from me the minute that you died. To have you in my life was all I ever wanted. But now without you, I'm a soul forever haunted. Can't help but feel that I had taken you for granted. No way in hell that I can never comprehend this. What do you mean, wrong game, McValium? Oops. No, don't keep playing. I don't want more music. I want to start the stream. Pink. Yeah, I finished the CW challenge as well. It was a uh, bright period in my morning, which has otherwise been going downhill the last hour or so. All right. So. Yep, hack and slay. Well, in this case, spell and slay. I'm uh, gonna be playing as the second character, Hugo. I got him through the uh, opening story stuff at the end of the last stream after we beat the game with Unica, and uh, so we'll be playing with Hugo here, getting through probably at least the first boss. 
Yeah, I got a, a fair number of wins, although the very last match where I got my uh, the match score finally, we just did assy. I mean, I had an awful fucking team. Me and one person got about 1400 damage. Um, the average damage on the team was like 300 otherwise. So I don't have any spells yet, other than, of course, the super conspicuous one that I'm using right there. No charge attacks or anything yet. Super weak compared to Unica, but I seem to remember Unica being really weak to start off with. There. Uh, way too many people try to bring LRM boats, period. There's just way too much um, ECM in the game to do that right now. So I'll immediately use the first Panacea. Give me some more HP here. But yeah, I mean, it was fun. The whole thing, and I, I've said it so many times on the stream, is... Um, the biggest problem that CW has had is that they never, when they first started it up, they didn't separate the uh, group and solo queues. And so what that led to is um, um, all these people who were pug players, for the most part, realized that CW was never going to be fun for them going up against groups, and they just stopped playing. Um, if they had uh, separated the group and solo queues in CW, I think it would be a lot more alive than it is. But what can you do? The Ceruleum Flabellum. I can now use Force Shield, okay, per spell. What does this one do? Obviously it creates a shield, but... Okay, it lets him glide. Or absorb a couple strikes. Doesn't look like it has any combat skill. Yeah, honestly, the sea bells are pretty good for, for the time versus match investment a lot of the time you're you're putting in the same amount of time that you would put in for um, you know several normal matches and you get about the same oops um, you end up getting about the same total C bills give or take. That is the big thing. And, and this again goes back to why it would be so much better um, if the cues were separated. Because then you would probably get wins in a more consistent basis. But, you know, it is what it is. <laughs> Thanks for the host there, Orc. This character plays so much differently than Unica. It's gonna take a while to get used to him. See, McValium, I'm on Steiner, too. Um, and I had a win earlier where I got one million before the post-match bonuses. 
So, I mean, it was a great investment as far as that went. <laughs> wow, that makes it so much harder to jump. <laughs> Gonna have to get used to that. Alright, I think we'll just charge this up first. Wait until I need it to hit it. Just barely made that. Yeah, actually the, the match where I got that uh, million dollar prize, um, randomly like two or three of the beer warriors were in there with me. I think it was three of us total. And uh, all three of us did pretty well. Well, Orcris, that's what you get for having dead friends. Way to go. I think the biggest challenge with this character eh, is that with Unico, she had a knockback, like a pretty hefty one on her skills, and it would stun shit. Uh, Hugo does not have a knockback, and boy does it show. Okay. So we're doing this again. Same thing happened to Unica, so... <laughs> Let's fuck off and play Ark and Girlfriend's Vagina. That's a sentence. <laughs> Oops, sorry, I keep forgetting not to go through the damn text so quick. He kicked himself because he fell into a trap. No sense in dwelling on it, I just need to make my way back to that room, and then find some means of countering the spell long enough to get through. And we'll go ahead and talk to this guy. Let's see what kind of blessings you can get. Well, I should always strengthen the armor. Can't really do anything else just yet. Oh, that's right. I gotta find the necklace thing for that first. <laughs> oh, yay! Our first teleporting enemies. Orc, I don't know that I have ever considered having a day of sex being a waste of a day. And I'm pretty sure you and I are about the same age. So yeah, I'm gonna echo uh, McVallion's old man comment here.
No, not gonna make that yet. I mean, okay, Orc, but... I don't know that you're gonna enjoy it. Doesn't really seem like your thing. <laughs> That's what you get for having kids, actually. You did it to yourself. I don't want to go that way yet. I'll go get the chest first. Kids age you in the worst way. Both my fiance and I were very honest with each other about uh, neither one of us wants kids. I sure as hell don't want them. I have no patience. Like, I'm perfectly happy being an uncle, but I want a, I want like a dog. I like dogs. They're better than people. <laughs> I like most dogs better than I like most people. And I sure as hell like them better than I like most kids. Did I mean to come back this way? I don't think I did. No, I missed a Rue somewhere. <laughs> Why am I full of shit? D5 has 16 chapter. I th I didn't remember. It was 14 or 15. It was somewhere around there. But 16, that means you get that much more game. I just want to be there when you get to the end of the chapter you're on. Ah, this is where I thought it was going. Just went down the wrong hall is all. Thankfully, I had a shield. Shields kind of hacks, actually. <laughs> oh, boo hoo! It'll just take you that much longer to get through. Quit your bitching. Decided to do your bed? Gross. Forks a mattress file. We haven't even done the post game. There's so much stuff that you don't that you won't even know about in the story. Shield wore off right as that guy hit me. Ray bouncy spot. You know, I honestly considered stopping East Origin after the first character. 
but I wanted to get the full uh, story experience. And I still got two whole games to play after this in this series. So I's got a way to go. Hey, powered up the shield. All I will tell you, Orc, is uh, you should get into the habit of looking at abilities more often. That sucks. I just found out today that, um, that I've been kind of flip-flopping. So, a couple days ago, uh, we've had a new girl who's been getting trained to work the graveyard shift. Because the other guy who's working graveyards um, was looking at switching to days. So he's only been working two nights a week. That's why my days off of, uh, um, have all been fucked. <clears throat> But, um, so we've been training this new girl, and a couple days ago, she just no-showed on us. And we were like, oh, what the fuck? What the hell's going on? So I was figuring, okay, she's probably quit. That means we're going to have to start this whole process over. And, um, but then yesterday she finally called in and said, okay, she... No showed because her daughter was in a car accident on Thanksgiving and um, you know she was taking care of her at the hospital didn't even really think about us kind of annoying but one of those excuses we can accept and uh, she talked to the managers all yesterday said she was gonna be there today as of about 45 minutes ago she still hasn't shown up so now I'm back to thinking that my schedule is completely fucked again I was going to be off Thursday, Friday, Saturday this coming week, but I don't think, uh, I don't think that's going to happen. So I go in tonight and, um, figure out what the hell my schedule is for the coming week. But it means that everything I've been waiting for and hoping for for last month is probably not going to happen. Yeah, I agree, McFarlane. She's probably gone. <clears throat> So yeah, I, I'm in kind of a shitty mood this morning. I was going to play some Black Ops and then realize, like, if I play that, I'm going to be salty as fuck. Same thing with Mech Warrior, so... I just decided I would do this. piece of Claria ore that I don't think I can use for a... Oh shit, it already strengthened it for me. I forgot that happened. It's the later ones that I have to unlock the other guy to get uh, my weapons upgraded. Yeah, orc, it's, it's pretty fucking stupid. I don't understand this girl's malfunction. Either way, I just had a friend of mine also apply, so maybe he'll get the job, and he kind of wanted to work nights too, so... If he wants the graveyard, he can potentially get it. Ah, oh, that extra damage is so nice. But yeah, so... We'll see how long it takes to actually get an answer. I mean, for all I know, she just showed up right after I called. I've only um, walked out of one job ever. And honestly, I needed to walk out of it. It's the only job where I've ever felt it was justified. Because the place was such a shithole and was so awful to its employees. Like, I was ready to jump off the fucking roof for the only job I've ever had where the, the bosses I had just made me want to fucking kill myself. It was so bad. Um, 
to put it into perspective, the uh, the woman I worked for um, had something like a 280% turnover rate. Uh, in other words, like rate of people getting fired who were or not fired, just quitting when they worked there. Um, and it was all her. Like everyone just despised this woman that we worked for. Um, and she just couldn't seem to get fired. Uh, she got fired after I quit about six months later. Um, she was, like, drinking on the job. She was illegally modifying someone's time card to fuck them out of commissions. All sorts of things. Um, but, like, absolute hellhole type place to work. So I, I felt a little bit justified in walking out of that piece of shit job. But other than that, I've never walked out of a job. I've always given a two weeks notice. I haven't, you know, fucked around the whole time and burned my bridges. In other words, I haven't been a shithead. Oh, it's these two. The girl's voice says, I wonder where he went. Hello. It's a Pona and Kishgal, that's the guy's name. Who knows? He's a sorcerer, so maybe he has some kind of spell to hide himself. <laughs> he sure didn't waste any time getting his pasty ass away from us, did he? Still can't figure out what the deal is with this mask he dropped, though. Who are you people? Another sorcerer. It's like an infestation. And this one's a regular stuffed shirt, too. Probably the dull and humorless type. I don't appreciate having to repeat myself. Who are you? There should be no humans left on the surface aside from our own search party. Did you come here from outside of East? Ha ha ha, what a question. Where the hell else would we have come from, dumbass? Hey, Kishkal, you mind if I do the honors? Losing that r that runt's trail pissed me the hell off. I could go for a good kill right about now. <laughs> do what you want. I'm not interested in fighting sorcerers. Tappa 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 walks away. Hey! Sorry, pal. I'm the one you'll be fighting. Epona's the name, and combat's my game. I'm a master of the trident, as you'll soon be learning firsthand. I figure three points are better than one, you know? He seems nonplussed. <laughs> you sorcerer types are really annoying, you know that? You're all stoic and moody, acting like you're so much better than everyone else. Well, I was told to kill everyone except the goddesses, and let me tell you, I'm really looking forward to this. Sounds kind of like Etna. <laughs> the hell are you laughing at? Oh, nothing. It's just that you sized me up rather quickly and decided you didn't like me. And I impulsively did the same to you. See, I can't stand women who talk too much. On top of that, your sense of style is severely lacking, your trident is laughably cheap looking, and you seem... overall unintelligent. <laughs> oh, he's a dick! <laughs> yes, Etna did use a trident in D2. Epona, was it? If you're gonna fight me, just get it over with. This should prove most educational for you. <laughs> you son of a bitch. You think you're hot stuff, huh? I'll knock some sense into that smug head of yours. Alright. Oh, wow, he's super slow. I forgot about that.
Ah, stop it. Stop it. Actually lost that fight. I can't believe that. He's so fucking slow. That's better. <laughs> Looks like you're the one who got some sense knocked into you. After, you know, a try. <laughs> Let's just ignore that part. Another magic infused relic from Ys? Damn you! I am impressed you're able to move so swiftly after what you've just been through. Whatever savage tribe you came from must have put great value on training one's constitution. <laughs> I'm no savage, you asshole! I'm a darkling and proud of it. Darkling? Ah, shit. I can't believe I lost to a pompous ass like you. I must have underestimated your abilities, because I sure as hell didn't overestimate mine. Uh, personally, I'd say your abilities aren't as well honed as you think. If they were, you'd simply have known right away that you were simply no match for me. Well, you just gotta come back for everything, don't you? I hate- I love how much of a dick this guy is. How about we go for a second round? Then you'll see what I could really- Hmm... What is it now? You look an awful lot like him. Maybe I'm just imagining it, but I swear I could see a resemblance. To whom are you referring? Never mind. I'll let you off easy for now. Just be ready for what's coming to you next time we meet. W wait! Ah, uh, wage imbalance problems over there in the chat. Yeah, I think we all have a little bit of that. Oh, still, if she's a darkling, then that all but confirms everything Father said. He really is here somewhere. I bet I know who he's talking about, because I've already played the game once. save.
Trust me, Orc, your kids are taxing on everyone. can't really wear this around enemies because it doesn't let you see where they are. And there we go. Hugo? Hugo, is that you? Who? who? Hugo removed the mask of eyes from his face. And there's Rico. Rico. Rico Gemma. Thank the goddesses you're safe. I've been so worried about everyone. What with the transport spell bursting and flinging us all over creation? I'm glad to see you're safe as well, but why are you this far into the tower already? Father Xion said you to accompany me? Huh? I'm not sure if I follow. Explain to him everything that's happened. Lady Rhea and Lady Fina are in here? I have no idea! I just happened to be lying in a heap in front of this tower when I woke up. There were demons all around me, and I was choking on all the noxious vapors outside, so I figured I'd take my chances in here. But, of course, those same two thugs you encountered caught sight of me and gave me a chase. So here I am, hiding behind a wall. And an excellent hiding place it is. They were thrown off your trail entirely. Though I must say, you really do have the most rotten luck. Heh <laughs> Ow! injured your leg from the chase, I assume? Yeah, one of them managed to get in a lucky hit. Don't even know which one. All I felt was a sudden intense pain. I guess, ironically, all that did was make me run faster, which was really quite unpleasant. I cast some healing magic on it, though, so it'll be fine a little while, but I won't be able to walk on it for the time being. Well, you should be safe here, at least. Just try to keep quiet and rest. Let the magic do its job. In the meantime, I'll continue working my way up the tower. Don't worry, I'll make certain Father Xi'an knows you're here. Much obliged. So, you wouldn't happen to know who those people chasing me actually were, would you? I don't recognize either of them, nor was their clothing anything I've seen before. I'm not entirely certain on the details, but I'm quite convinced that they came from outside of East. And they, too, seem to be seeking the goddesses. Outside of East? I wasn't aware people actually lived anywhere else. The thought never even crossed my mind, in fact. That information doesn't really help us much, though. The only important thing we know about them is that they're hostile. Which means we need to find Lady Rhea and Lady Fina before they do. Yeah, I'd say that's a given. Oh, hey, before you go... I have something you might want to take with you. Da da! Now I can get through that trap room. Isn't this your family's charm? Right. My father loaned it to me. It's supposed to have the power to ward off evil. As long as you're wearing it, enemy magic, like that trap spell you described, should have far less of an effect on you. Ah, I see. That sounds most useful indeed. You have my thanks. See you later, dude. <laughs> it's nice having a ranged attack that I don't have to charge up every five fucking seconds.
might as well equip this before I forget about it. Well, that takes care of that. I'm a bit shocked to find such sophisticated magic being used in this tower, though. I wonder if those outsiders were responsible for it. Or perhaps it was... him. H Hugo? Oh. Oh, it's... A character I don't think I've met, or barely met in, in the other playthrough. Musha, I don't know how to actually pronounce that. Hey! Hugo, it's really you. Praise the goddesses. I was so afraid that something might have happened to you. Oh, come now. How fragile do you think I am? I'm more concerned about you. Where did you land? Did you have any trouble getting to the tower? <laughs> no, I made it okay. Fortunately, I was with her the whole time, said a woman's voice. So, you're in one piece as well, Kadena. Okay, I do remember these two. More or less. Musha and I woke up not far from one another. Dino managed to track us down, and we only just arrived here a short while ago. <coughs> Good to see his efforts are bearing fruit. So, Hugo, is it really true that Lady Rhea and Lady Fina are in this tower? It would seem so, yes. But they're not the only ones. Huh? Hugo detailed all the events that have occurred since we started the game. Wow, people from outside of East. That definitely makes this situation more urgent. We'll need to discuss this matter with Xion and formulate a more organized plan of attack. It may even benefit us to get in touch with the six priests if time and circumstances permit. I'll leave all that in your capable hands. Meanwhile, I intend to continue scaling this tower. T Hugo? Will you be alright on your own? Of course. I'll try to gather as much information I can as I can until everyone's been assembled. Well, can I go with you? I've got healing magic after all. It could come in pretty handy if you get... If you get into a bind. I believe that service would be better afforded to Rico, given his injuries. With your aid, I'm certain he could be back on his feet in no time. Uh... Yeah, I guess you're right. Oh, man, is he ever clueless. Okay, then. I guess that settles that. We'll go help Rico recover, and then reconvene with Xion. You'll be careful in here, alright? I will. You two do the same. See you later, Hugo! So many girls voiceovers I'm gonna have to do if I keep doing this. Sooner or later I'll get tired of talking, though. Slowly but surely, it seems the search party is taking shape once more. Once the Holy Knights have started combing this place, it'll be tough for me to keep moving without constant interruption. I need to make as much progress now as I possibly can. Aww, secret mission. D -d -d.
Hey, booties. I got the booty. So much easier than they were for Unica. Nothing like just being able to shoot through their shield and not give a shit. Hmm, which way do I want to go first? Let's try to clear out this room first and then decide. He just stands there because he's trying to block. Enemies were definitely coded to handle Unica and not uh, Hugo. Wow, one of my fucking little shooters just got separated from me. That's special. <laughs> I didn't notice until just now, but every time I fire, it edges me just a little bit forward. Okay, so this is a trap. But again, they're not really coded well to fight this particular character, so they're kind of fucking worthless. <laughs> You guys are the worst traps ever. Like a little walking Galaga ship. Getting close to the first boss. Shouldn't take too horribly long now. I'll probably get through the first boss and honestly call it a stream there. I'm a little worn out and emotionally drained from the way this morning's gone.
Look, let's see if we go first boss. There it is. Can't remember what this boss does. Despite the fact that I just beat the game the first time through, I've forgotten this boss. I, I remember, like, from the second boss forward. Let's see what blessings I got, actually. Uh, oh, leggings I should strengthen, take a little bit less damage. Um, uh, honestly, I almost never used the stationary heal rate, so that can wait. What I really need to do is get up to 16,000. Um, I also need to do that so they're a little bit more powerful. We'll get there. Oh, I remember this one, actually. I have to jump up its arms and hit its head. That's right. The Beast's Chamber. What a conspicuous room. It's a much larger room than I'd expect to find here, and completely empty, no less. Ha ha ha! Shit. Which means it's probably a trap. The enemy is most likely to come from... Above! And there we are. Can't say this is quite what I was expecting. Must be one of the six enormous demons that attacked Ys. Well, you've met your match, demon. I have the eyes of fact on my side. It's time I put them through their paces. Oh my god, so annoying. Oh right. This is annoying fucking bugs. Beep. Bad touch, bad touch. Stop that! No, oh, no, I'm oh, fucked.
come on, jump. Oh, come on. Damn it, get up there. There. Nice and easy, but that boss was pretty easy for Unica, too. Granted, she had a slightly bigger pain in the ass, but... Cool. Nice, quick and easy stream. Well, that was a bit more of a struggle than I'd anticipated. Those outsiders are capable of controlling demons like that. Dot dot dot. Punch my pop filter. No, again, I mustn't dwell. What ifs can do us no good. I need to proceed onward. The goddesses must be found. Yes. Save point up here. And there we go. All the way to the flooded prison. It's a nice quick run. Alright. So it's about 9.30. A little earlier than I usually stop. But honestly, like I said, I'm, I'm pretty kind of worn out and tired from the way uh, today uh, worked. So yeah. I'm going to go ahead and call it there, you guys. Um, I might play again a little bit tomorrow morning, though. Or maybe even tonight, just depending on how I feel. So, in any case, uh, for now, good night. Have fun. We will see you next time. And uh, maybe I'll do some Mech Warrior tonight. I don't know. haven't decided. But see you all later.